Hey guys, Avenger here. Today I'll be showing my exotic collection. This includes my armor and weapons which I collected over the past few months. Now, they're all in my vault at the moment. And then note that I do not have every exotic so far. I'm still missing quite a f lot, actually. So, let's go through the armor first. For my Titan, I got the Armamentarium, which I got yesterday from the Nightfall. So you see, there's no upgrade at the moment. I also have two in, in an insurmountable skull fort. It's a pretty good helmet. And the glass house, which I bought from Vzur a few weeks ago. The armamentarium gives you carry additional grenade, which is pretty good. And insurmountable skull fort, which it gives you transfusion. So each time you pummel, you can health regen. And you spawn with grenade energy. The glass house lasts blessings of light and weapons of light last longer. It's like 15 seconds, I think. And no backup plans. I have never tried it out yet. And now go to the hunter. I got two Aclear Fade symbiotes. Uh, this one has a better stat roll, so I kept this one. I also have two ATS 8 Arachnid. Which is not a pretty, not a good helmet for uh, the DLC. Aclophase Symbiote allows you to gain one additional shot. That's four, which is very good in PvP and PvE. And here I got Mask of the Fern Man. Uh, very good for Blade Dancer. Arc Blade uses less super energy. I got Young Haim Kara Spine today from uh, Engram. So. Uh, it apparently lasts up to 30 seconds, I think. And don't touch me. I got this from I got this from Zer last week. Although the stats this week is way better, but there's no point buying me again, buying it again. What I really like is uh, doing the abyss in Crota's End, where you can solo the first part using these gloves. Now to my uh, warlock armor. I got Starfire Protocol, which gained additional fusion grenade. Heart of the Praxic Fire, which further decreases all ability cooldowns while Radiance is active. Got this from the Nightfall, as you've seen before. Claws of Ahamkara. Gain additional charge for Scorch and Energy Drain. Great for PvP and PvE. Uh, Apotheosis Veil. This is the old one, I didn't upgrade it because I didn't thought it would be necessary. You activating your super regen, your health, and obsidian mind. Nova bomb kills reduces the cool Nova bomb kill reduce the cooldown of your next Nova bomb. Very good in PVE, especially if you like using Nova bombs. Skull of Dire Ahamkara, tougher while using Nova bomb. Improve energy drain. Uh, I'm, I haven't tried this helmet yet, but it's it should be okay, but I don't use it much of. And Sunbreakers, increase the duration of your solar grenade. I had an old one which I removed earlier for an exotic shard. So, and I got this one from an engram. And the last is Void Fan Vestments. I bought this like ages ago and there's no point upgrading it. And I don't remember so being... I think he did offer an upgrade, but I didn't do it. Now we're going to the weapons. No land beyond, I got given it PvP. Not a good weapon at the moment. An invective, which is you can get it from a bounty. Universal remote, a primary shotgun. I got this from a night four and one in a raid I think. And then pocket infinity, you can get it from a bounty. Fawn, one of the hardest bounty I've done uh, for an exotic. It's a very good prime, uh, very good hand cannon. Definitely worth it if you haven't got it yet. Suros regime. I bought this from Zer like a few months ago, and then I upgraded on the first week the DLC was released. Thunderlord. I got given this in raid. I, re I think it was. It was from Atheon, I think. And patience and time, I bought it from Zer. I have two Yellow Horns, which I've got one in Nightfall and one in 
PvP. I have four icebreakers. I have two here, but I also two in the in my special slot. Well, I bought one icebreaker and the rest all given, so I was pretty lucky on icebreakers. Plan C. The the three thirty one one I got it from a nightfall, and this one I bought from Zer a few months ago. Red Death, I have two of them. Uh, I think both of them were from Raid, I think. The last word. Uh, one I bought and one I got given in a chest in uh, Vault of Glass. And Bad Juju. I haven't used it yet, but I've used the old one, which was bef the, before the buff. It was pretty bad. I haven't upgraded yet since I was quite limited on Glimmer and I'm still collecting. I have still have other weapons to upgrade. Uh, so this is the new one I've done recently. I have an old one here, which I did not actually use that much. And I think that is all the exotic, that's all the exotic weapons I have so far and armor. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you next time. Bye.